hello everyone welcome back to the channel all of my boss buddies i hope you guys are doing wonderful i hope you are doing well on this beautiful saturday day um it's really cloudy here in north carolina but nevertheless it is a beautiful day a day above ground so guys listen what is everyone up to today i want to say thank you for those of you that continues to continues to follow my channel and watch all the videos and for those of you that are on for the first time welcome 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 to this great community all you got to do is hit subscribe and now you are part of the boss lady community guys so listen i am out today shopping i'm alone today all by myself which is very very rare guys that i'm by myself but um today i'm by myself and I'm traveling about an hour or so out of um, my town so that I can go shopping and see what some of the other stores have and what some of you great shoppers have left behind. So thus far, I've only been to um, quite a few Dollar Generals and I have picked up some items that were left behind. Nothing too major. Um, one store, I did get four men's gift sets that were still in the store for 50 cents. And I, of course, pick those up. You know, a, a lot of people are looking for the women items and kind of leaving the men's stuff behind. But I don't leave absolutely nothing behind because that actually helps me build my stockpile for all the awesome holidays that are on the way, for the birthdays, for the anniversaries, all of that type of stuff. So never, never leave things behind if you can afford it. And they're marked to a great price like that. Never leave them behind because even if you don't sell them in a basket, it may be somebody's birthday or whatever occasion it may be. And to keep you from going out to buy something, you'll already have it there. So that's the benefit of having a stockpile, not just so that you can build items for your baskets, but also if you need to give out items as gifts, right? So y'all, I have been finding some amazing hauls. I have not yet found the time where I could go through the entire haul with you all. I've shown you clips and I've also shown you photos, but I have not actually had the time to go through those items. Believe it or not, they're still sitting in my living room on the floor because I have been busy shopping, okay? So when I'm shopping for an after, um, after season clearance, I put my total attention on that one thing because once the clearance is gone, it's gone. Once the items in the store are gone, they're gone, okay? So I'm like, okay, I can put that stuff up anytime. It's in my living room. It's not bothering anybody. So I'm gonna probably take the time um, tomorrow to get all of those things organized and situated. So hopefully I can get a great video showing you guys um, I was gonna do an unbagging video. Y'all know I like to come up with these crazy names. I know a lot of people talk about unboxing, but I wanted to do an unbagging with you guys. But to be honest, I've taken almost everything out of the bag. So maybe what I'll do is an inventory reveal, okay? Maybe we'll call it that, an inventory reveal. I like that. Um, but anyway, y'all, so we are going to um, we're going shopping at the Pottery, guys, in Smithfield, North Carolina. I don't know if you've ever heard of it. I do know that there are other potteries in other places. I don't know if it's just other places in North Carolina or if there are other places around the world. But anyway, guys, you are going to be in for a treat. It is the Crafters Designers Dream, okay? That store is the dream for any crafter or designer they have all kinds of flowers they have all kinds of ribbon they have so many many things that you can design with so we will be there shortly guys okay i'll see you in a moment
ride. Y'all, we have finally made it to the Carolina Pottery, but of course, y'all know I had to stop at a couple more stores before. We stopped at the Family Dollar just to see if the gift sets had went down any lower, and they have not, so y'all know we did leave them on the shelves. So anyway, guys, come on, let's get ready to go into the crafter's heaven, okay? See you guys in a few. Lord y'all this is a big store I know y'all complaining like how much more do we have to look at but honey get you some popcorn and kick back we got a few more moments of shopping 